Medical abbreviations they expect you to know in nursing school. So BID is two times a day, TID three times a day, and QID four times a day. These are used to describe how frequently medications are given. Or they can also explain how often a treatment will be performed. Q is used to describe frequency. So Q pretty much equals every. When we look down below, Q2H equals every two hours, Q3H every three hours, every six hours. The following are used to describe most often when medications are given. So HS describes at bedtime, AC is before a meal, PC following a meal, PRN as needed, and STAT it's to be given immediately. MPO means nothing by mouth. If you see DX or TX, DX stands for diagnosis and TX stands for treatment. VS stands for vital signs and if you see VSS, that stands for vital signs stable. So SS stands for signs and symptoms and WNL stands for within normal limits. So for example, WNL within normal limits could be used to describe the patient's vital signs. So these abbreviations here describe different types of injections. ID stands for interdermal, IM is intramuscular, and SQ is subcutaneous. Over on this side, these describe different medication routes. So IV stands for intravenous, PO stands by mouth, and SL stands for sublingual, so underneath the tongue. These stand for the different quadrants on the abdomen, so right upper quadrant, left upper quadrant, right lower quadrant, and left lower quadrant. These can be helpful to describe where a patient is experiencing abdominal pain, and as well when describing bowel sounds. DNR is a code status, and it is the opposite of a full code. DNR is do not resuscitate, and DC means discharge. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. These were just some terms that I know when I went into nursing school, I wish that I had of pre-planned and memorized a bit before my first clinical placement because they are so helpful to know. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe and comment down below if you would like another part to this abbreviation video. I could also do different medical conditions as well. Thank you so much for watching.